in this lesson we are going to take care of tags and categories so what we want is if a user clicks on this link you should take the user to the page only for blog posts in this category same thing with the tags so let's get started the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to our web.php and register some routes so i'm going to have a route which is going to be a get and this is going to be blog slash categories and then the category right here and this is going to go to the post controller and the category method so here i'm gonna have category okay and then i'm just gonna give this a name of block dot category and i'll just duplicate this for tag so here i'm gonna have tags and i'm gonna have tag the method is gonna be called tag and the name is gonna be block dot tag awesome so let's go to this post method and we'll create a method public function category and this is going to be used to display the category page so what we want to use is route model binding right here to get the category so i'm just going to use app category right there and then here we're going to return view block dot category with category and we'll pass category right there awesome then we'll do exactly the same thing for tags so i'm gonna say tag okay and this is gonna be called tag and the variable tag so here we're passing tag and the name of the key is gonna be tag and the view is tag awesome so we want to come to the views so which is resources views block and here i'm gonna have category the blade dot php and then i'm gonna have tag dot blade dot php so this is almost gonna be like the welcome page so i'm just gonna copy the welcome page okay then into a partial notice i have partials right here i'm gonna create one called sidebar dot blade dot php and then from the welcome dot blade i'm gonna copy the sidebar that we have which is right here and then i'm gonna cut it out and here i'm gonna include partials dot side bar okay just so that we have this clean in a different file so i'm going to come to the sidebar and paste this right here and so we can reuse it okay so i'm just going to indent it and then in a in a category dot blade dot php we also can cut this out completely and replace it with include partials dot sidebar in this view we need to pass the post so this is what we're gonna do in the post controller we can actually pass the category and then we can also pass the post so we can say with post and this is going to be thanks to our relationship category post just like that and then we can actually paginate the results by saying category post simple paginate and we can paginate by three if we want okay then we can do the same thing with the tag so i'm just going to copy this query right here and paste it here so with post and this is going to be tag post simple paginate by three the last piece of the puzzle let's just go to the category dot blade make sure everything is fine i'm just going to say category and this is going to be category name and then for the head section we're not going to have latest blog post we're going to have the name of the category so here i'm just going to print out category name okay and then right down here since we already have the post variable defined everything is supposed to work fine i think this is great what we want to do is make sure from our welcome the categories have a link to that page so i'm just going to search for category and yeah i think it's in the sidebar so we want to go to the partial right so in this partial what we want to do is add a link right here so if i come here i'm going to add a route and this is going to be blog dot category and i need to pass in the category id right here for the dynamic parameter okay so if i refresh and hover over this you can see it goes to category okay 
now that we are here you can see it says undefined variable categories and that's because in our sidebar.blade.php we are trying to use categories but then we haven't defined that variable from our post controller so here we can also add with categories and this is going to be category all okay so if i refresh right now we have tags that is not defined so we want to define that too so i'm just going to have these on separate lines so that it looks a little cleaner so i'm going to have the final width and this is going to be tags and we're going to have tag all so if i refresh right now great so you can see right now we have block categories three and this is partnership and you can see the results right here paginated if we search for minimalist you can see no results found for minia if i remove the a great you can see the results right there so the reason is this search only points to the welcome route right so what we could do is modify it in such a way that a user can actually search the categories okay that's gonna be really useful let me show you how we can achieve that in the sidebar right now the search submits to welcome we can remove this and it's gonna submit to the current page so let me show you if i come back to the home page and then go to the partnership category and then i search for minimalist hit enter you can see the search is still on this page but it doesn't search right now okay because we haven't implemented the search functionality for the categories because right now if you see the post controller what we are doing is we're just fetching the category post and then we're simply paginating it okay so what we want to do is get the search so we can say search is equal to request query and then we'll get the search keyword okay and if search and then we're gonna return or actually we're gonna say post equals category post and then we're gonna say where the title is like and then we're gonna use this double quotes for the percentage and then we're gonna embed the search right here and then we're gonna say simple paginate of three values right there okay so that's a search and then else we're gonna say post is equal to category post then simple paginate of three values and right here we're just gonna pass in post okay so that's how we can add search for only the category itself so if i refresh right now you can see it shows minimalist but if i search for zen you can see no results found for Zen under this specific category. That's awesome, right? But I'm not very happy with this and we're gonna refactor it in a second because we can do this over and over. We can come and do this for tags. It's getting a little difficult to read and it's really getting duplicated. So we're gonna fix that in a second, okay? But now let's just fix the tags. So here, wanna make sure we also load the categories and tags right here just like we did and then we want to create the tag.blade.php let me just copy everything in the category paste it in the tag like this and i think that should be good so here i want to say tag and want to say tag name and here we're also going to have tag name awesome so if i refresh these links do not work yet let's go ahead and make them work in the sidebar scroll right down to where we have our tags I'm just gonna change this to a valid link. So route blog.tag and I'm just gonna pass in tag ID right here for the specific tag. Awesome. Refresh, click on this, it takes us to the tag. Click on this one, it also takes us to the tag. Clicks on this one, it takes us to the tag. Awesome. All right, and if we even search, it's gonna show us this as you can see right here but we are not yet searching for the job. So we have the categories and tax page working. We have a lot of refactor to do for the search, which I'm gonna do in the next lesson when I teach you something awesome called scopes.